Well, I come to see Mom today. It's a little early. Um, Memorial Day, I think, is next month. But uh, I uh, I wanted to come and see her. And uh, visit her on a beautiful day. Got to go up and see Dad. Oh, gosh. There's so many um, people here. There's my loving grandmother. Here's the guy that gave me life. Sometimes I didn't appreciate him, but he gave me life and I was able to bring forth life. One of my favorite uncles right here. I tell you, he was my brother and I went to see him out in Ferndale, California. He's retired Navy. What a wonderful human being. And his brother Lynn right here, he, he was a hero to a lot of kids. He parachuted into Normandy. Oh, well, he actually went into St. Lo. Um, he landed on the shores of France as an MP. Yeah, this is a part of our little clan. I have some... Uh, Brothers and sisters, brothers, laying up in here. A lot of cousins over there. And down there. Some more family members over there. Let me just walk over. And uh, go pay them a visit. I was raised up loving our relatives. Life was hard for everybody. And uh, it was it was really hard for the coal mining families. And these are, all these people had their roots tied to coal. And uh, my family is no different. You know, the whole family, your daddy might be a coal digger or a truck driver, coal hauling coal. Whatever the role he played, uh, you can rest assured that the whole entire family was involved in it. Here's some, here's some of my favorite relatives. They never knew it, but I loved them always. There's Ain Ivan laying right there. And Walter, man, I remember, I remember him as a kid. He had uh, had some blasting caps to go off when he was working in the mines. Left some scars on him. Some good people here. There's a fine young man right there. We went to uh, 
Colorado. And um, we worked for a man out there. We were baling hay in Colorado. And James came and joined us. Oh, my God. Well, actually, we took James up there. Uh, he didn't come and join us. We, uh, we took James up to Colmont, Colorado. And, uh, oh, my God, he had such a good time. He was uh, just a good human being. But he certainly, um, he left lasting memories with me. Well, I don't want to drag this on too long. But I just wanted to uh, come and see Mom. And, uh, and the family. Ma. That's what we called her. Ma. Ma was Ma to everybody. She was a sweet, wonderful human being. She taught me a lot about life. This is where I'll be laid. Uh, mother got the first spot. And uh, I'll be laid right here. This will be my little dirt spot right there. Now, see, the rule is, the way it works, this is a four-family plot. Mom's already got the first slot. And if I look out, I'll get the second slot. If not, my sister Joyce gets it. And uh, I think them's the only two that said they'd be buried here. I know Robert's going to be probably buried with his gang over in Arkansas. I don't have no clue. Okay, I will uh, I'll make sure I, I hope I got that good earlier. She's been gone since February the 26th, 2008. Golly, I had butter beans yesterday. Thought about her while I was eating my butter beans. <laughs> she, she made the best butter beans and taters. Uh, I am happy I got a chance to come out here today, so. With that, we'll say goodbye. Love each and every one of you. Bye, Mom.